everybody, how's it going? Well, we're unloading today. We've been hauling all day yesterday. Well, not all day, but a good two quarters of the day. Uh, I was unloading yesterday, Sean was loading, and today Sean is unloading. Because I had to go get fuel. We got the old 2290 given her. Uh, since our 2096 is down right now. Usually this tractor would be in the field. And the MX would be here because it's easier to uh, unload with that one. But it, this is what we used to use all the time. This is our only tractor with a loader. And uh, yeah, it serves us pretty well. got quite a few hours on it. I don't know, the hour meter quit working after 10,000. Well, I bet you she's got a good 15, 16,000 on her. But we don't use it that much anymore. I really wish I knew to put that small bale on there. Oh well. So yeah, we're mushroom stacking. We're mushroom stacking the bales. That's how we store it. Uh, they keep the best that way. So I'm just gonna. Well, I was gonna jump up on top there, but I don't want to. We've got about 300 here so far. There's three rows right there, and two more here. The old 2290s hydraulics are pretty slow compared to the newer tractors. We bought that Allied loader there, a brand new, when we got that tractor. Really good loaders, Allied. $7.95. I built that bale spear for it. Actually, I chopped it off an old... The spears I got from an old fork that we had on an older tractor. And then I made up the mounts and uh, welded it all onto there from an old truck crane. So yeah, that's got that uh, bale spear fork or whatever has got parts from three different uh, uh, three different things that it was used on. So. It's a big difference compared to last year. Here it was just a mud hole. We had to wait till it was frozen before we could even drive here. This was all wet. Big difference this year. Uh, we still got some straw stacked there. I gotta take those down and mushroom stack them because it's not good for them to sit in the pyramid stack like that. We should have used those first. And left uh, the other row. But I want the straw on the other side. So I've got her done. You can rev the hell out of it and it can get more speed out of that, that old pump. That <laughs> yeah, was slowly but surely. And that's that. That's why I've always liked those old cases with the power shift. Because it was the, uh, the closest thing to a shuttle shift you could get. Just pull the lever back, you're in reverse. Right, Sean? <laughs> so I'm going to put fuel in this truck now. How much you got? Quarter tank? Yeah. Alright, I ran that thing out of diesel one time. You don't want to run that thing out of diesel. That's a pain in the ass. You don't want to run anything out of diesel. But there's certain things you really don't want to run out of diesel. Alright. Thanks for watching, uh, leave your comments and uh, make sure you subscribe, click like too.